Hi there, it's Tony Buck again. What have I done this time? This is a solar soil sterilizer. A box, plexiglass, aluminum. Let me show you how it works. You want to sterilize soil when you're potting plants. So rather than buying potting soil, it's expensive. I made this collector. It's a styrofoam box with an aluminum uh, center. And you just pour the soil in like this on this sort of tray that I made. I'll show you those details later if you really want to get into it. But right now, let's just show you how it works. So that's just soil straight out of my compost heap mixed with a bit of garden soil. Going to just level it out. Those trays are one and a half inches deep. I used a two by four as a form. And uh, we're just going to put that together like that. It's a 40 degree day today. So the soil's about 40. In fact, some of it's frozen. And as you see the size of pot that I put in, probably about 10 pounds of soil. I don't know exactly. Anyway, I'm putting the thermo thermometer in the side there, under the soil, not just in the box. So I'm getting a real reading of soil. Here's an aluminum tray I made to fit over the top. And you're thinking, why not just put the plexiglass right over it? Well, uh, if you do, the whole thing fogs up and you lose your heat. So this is a tray that I made. It's a bit hokey, but I've, I've got foam all the way around the sides to seal the, the heat in. And uh, this is what happens if you don't do this. See, the glass just gets completely steamed up. A lot of heat uh, is in the soil and the steam, uh, the water vapor just comes out of it. So I put that, this is my little innovation to stop this from steaming up. I needed that tray. I'm putting plexiglass over the top. I think twin wall polycarbonate would be better. Um, again, it's sealed with foam. I put two wooden slats down the side because I needed to hold them on a little bit tighter um, and get that pressure so that the air didn't uh, get out. This has been going for an hour and a half. It got to 140 in an hour from 40 degree soil. It's now one and a half hours and it's about to tick over 159.9. It's about to tick over to 100 and 60 degrees Fahrenheit which is what many there it goes which is what I've been told by agriculturalists you need now um, I've got four half inch holes look at the steam coming out of there I've got four half inch holes in the side of this and every now and then I open up the aluminum foil tape and let that steam out so it doesn't end up coming even through my tray and into the front now uh, let's take the, this is two hours later, uh, taking the, the, the top off. And after 160 was hit at an hour and a half, it did go to 170 and stay there uh, and was keeping to climbing uh, all the way to two hours. So it was like this soil has been at 170 for half an hour. So um, that's quite enough, I think. I don't want to get it too, too, too much. There you go. If you can use that for potting soil, this is a solar soil sterilizer say that fast if you can if you want to see details they're coming up in a minute that's how much you get every two hours see you later or skip over to my tony fix it channel and look at the solar soil sterilizer that's a longer version and it will give you lots of details on how to make it okay good luck